Hello friends. Today we will see how to retrieve a gene sequence from NCBI. So on Google Chrome we can just type NCBI. So it is we see here it is the National Center for Biotechnology Information. We click on this and it is the home page of NCBI that is National Center for biotechnology information now in all databases we have to select the nucleotide as we have to retrieve a gene sequence then we have to mention here the name of the organism for example i will type anona squamosa we can also specify the gene sequence for example rbcl gene now then click on search so according to our query there are 12 atoms means till now 12 sequences of anonasquamosa rbcl gene had been submitted on ncbi so we will retrieve the first one Now it is the information of the first gene sequence that is Anonasquamosa RBCL gene. In this page there is the detailed information regarding this gene sequence. It have a particular submission number on gene bank. Now the important informations in this are it is of 1369 base pairs, it is a DNA, it is linear and it is submitted on 26th of July 2016. Now there are other informations like the name of the organism, then its hierarchy, name of author, title, journal and other thing. Now the last important thing that is the sequence of RBCL gene and it is in written in origin. So, it is the gene sequence of RBCL gene of NNS camosa. But when we have to utilize the gene sequence in phonetic reproduction, we need the FASTA format. So, if we click on FASTA, we will get the FASTA format of the gene sequence. So, you can see here it is the FASTA format of the gene sequence. Now, if we need these gene sequence, then we can simply select all the gene sequence, right click on it and copy the gene sequence. Now, we can make a word file. I simply name it as a sequence. Now, we can open the word file and we can add paste the gene sequence over here. So by this we can understand how to retrieve a gene sequence from NCBA. I hope you enjoyed the lecture. Thank you very much.